it's important that we have you know policies in place that are, are working to incentivize uh, communities, developers to provide affordable housing whenever possible. Uh, and there's a lot that can be done uh, at the federal level, but also at the state and local level to make sure you're giving incentives uh, to developers when they are building homes. If you make you know X percentage that are going to be affordable housing, you get this benefit. Uh, you can also do that with regards to uh, you know climate change is something I care deeply about. And it's something that we have a lot of opportunity here in the 25th district uh, in order to uh, really be a leader in the clean energy economy that's coming forward. Uh, and one part of that can be building more energy efficient homes that are smaller, that take up less space, that are more affordable. And so if you put policies in place that incentivize building some of those developments, it's not only great for our community, great for our planet, uh, as we go forward. It not only will create jobs as you do it, but it will also help bring some more affordable housing to whatever area you start implementing these policies. Uh, and so we need to make absolutely certain that when we build and develop, we are considering uh, whatever options we have to, to put aside some percentage for affordable housing so that we can make sure everyone in our community is able to stay in our community and continue being a part of that community.